Imam Ahmad rahimahullah, was a giant in his time. A giant in his time, and this was before the time of social media, where people could connect the name to the face. Everyone in the Muslim lands knew of Imam Ahmad. One day, Imam Ahmad, he decides that I'm going to travel, and he, he, he dressed in a way that was very modest. He didn't want any unnecessary attention coming his way. He arrives at the city, and it's time to prepare for the night. And as he's preparing for the night, he goes to the masjid, for it was a custom at that time that the travelers would spend the, time, the night in the masjid. The carekeeper of that masjid, he says, no, no, uh, in our masjid, we're not, we can't do that. Imam Ahmad, he says, okay. He, step, he steps outside and he starts making preparations to sleep outside. When a baker, a local baker, saw him, not knowing it was Imam Ahmad, he says, no, no, I, I, I find it inappropriate that a traveler comes to our city and he sleeps outside. Tonight you will sleep in my bakery. Imam Ahmad, he agrees. He goes to the bakery and Imam Ahmad, he tries to rest. And Imam Ahmad, he notes that the entirety of the night, this baker, he was kneading his dough and he was doing dhikr of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Subhanallah, walhamdulillah, wa la ilaha illallah, allahu akbar. Allahumma salli ala Sayyidina Muhammad. Astaghfirullah wa atubu alayhi. Right? All these different forms of dhikr. And in the morning, Imam Ahmad, he asks this, this, this baker, he says, by Allah, this thing that you do is a commendable thing. Have you seen any benefits in your life? And the baker, he says, by Allah, I have never asked for a dua to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, except that it has been accepted. Right? Subhanallah. And then he says, there's this one thing, however. There's this one dua that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, he hasn't answered. And Imam, Imam Ahmad, he says, what is this? What is this dua? And the baker, he says, I wish I've always had the dream and I've made dua that I get to meet Imam Ahmad. And subhanAllah, Imam Ahmad's right in front of him, right? He spent the night in his bakery, right? Never underestimate the power of the dhikr, of the connection and the remembrance of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala.